What is going on all you YouTubers, this is CodeAgent10 and welcome to episode 3 of Coding with Code. And today I'm going to show you how to create a very simple timer effect using Notepad. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you want to get your Notepad ready here. You want to open it up. Um, and then you want to encrypt the code. I am not going to waste your time typing it all in, I'm literally just going to copy and paste it all in. All of this will be in the description below, so if you want to just open up Notepad and copy and paste it all in, feel free to do so. Um, now I'm just going to quickly show you how to save it. So basically what you want to do is you want to go into File, go to Save As, select a particular document or file, whatever that you want to save it in. Uh, I've got it all on desktop because I don't want to go into my files. And then you're just going to want to name it. So you want to go, I'm just going to type it in as um, countdown. If I can spell it right, because I can. And then you want to just go and type in dot bat bat. You must always have dot bat at the end of the file name so that it saves it as a bat file and so that the timer can actually operate correctly. Uh, you don't actually have to put it in all files, but I'm going to anyway because it's a lot less glitchy when it's on all files. So, and then you just want to save it. I'm just going to shrink that. Uh, and then you just want to open it up. Please click any key to continue to start the countdown. Starting countdown. Five, four, three. Two, one, zero. Goodbye. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm just being random. But yeah, that's how basically how you make a very simple countdown timer effect. You can edit the timer by simply going back into the editing process. And what you want to do is if you wanted to make it longer, is you basically just copy and pasted this over and over and over and over again and then you just set the number timer that you want here. I've just got it down to five seconds but I'm just going to show you what you can do. I'm going to set it to three seconds so what you could also do is just do that, get rid of, done, go to file, click save, shrink or close one or the other, open you back up, enter Startling countdown and there you go it's been set down to three seconds instead of five seconds and you can just kind of do stuff like that so yeah it's very simple um, if you found this tutorial helpful then please leave a like down below as it really does help me out and if you could click that subscribe button as well again that would really help me out and it's free so you might as well uh, <laughs> check out a few of my other videos as well if you're if you're new to my channel or whatnot yeah please feel free to check out some of my vids. Um, lately I've been making a lot more of these kind of notepad stuff and I will continue to make a lot of notepad stuff. So yeah, if you're interested in that then yeah, click the subscribe button. And uh, well, this is Code Agent 10 sign off. See you later YouTubers.